Hello, right, family. Well, My I name's to Toby Mincraft. No, it's not. <laughs> it's it, it's Finny Pooh. Just matter of perspective. Anyway. Hello, family. My name's Finny Pooh. And hello, everyone. This is Toby Mincraft. And welcome to... This is Terra Swoop Force, I guess. Indeed it right? is. Tell, tell, tell me about this. I, I don't know anything about this. So this is an Elytra map where you and I will be lobbing our way down three... ...trying to save a board drill from the center of the... Okay. So get ready for a journey to the center of the Earth. Okay, I got journey to the center of the Earth, and I think that's cool enough, so we'll go from there. <laughs> Now, of course, this resource pack that they made for this map is, oh my god, it's amazing. Oh, yeah. You haven't even seen the best part yet. First of all, the music. Made by um, Isaac Wilkins, which I will actually have a, um, a link to his band camp, as well as the video that I put up on my other channel, Tobin's Productions, because I uploaded the original audio for this, so I can listen to it whenever I want. And oh my goodness, I know, right? I think we're ready. I think so too. And for those of you who are wanting all those links, I'm going to just put a link to Toby's channel into the description. That way it's a little bit easier for everybody to kind of find everything that they're wanting to. So, and that way you can discover another amazing creator. Toby. Uh huh. Anyway. Now, this will also be going on to my um, new channel, Toby Minstraft. Yes. I changed my name from my original channel to Toby Minstraff Garage Band because most of my stuff there is Garage Band. So I don't want people to get confuzzled. Exactly. Are you ready? Let's fire it up. Whoa, okay. Are you hearing the sound? Just yeah. want to make sure. Helicopter. Do we have to jump? Yes, we do. Or just go down the ladder. Oh, it's oh, it landed. Texture. Okay, I thought I thought I was jumping out of the sky. I was like, oh no. <laughs> <laughs> ah, no, this is. Oh, that's cool. This is just beautiful. Look around, around this place. I mean, that's the most amazing thing you've ever seen. It looks like normal to me. Let's go over here. Let's. What's this? Bouncy castle. All right. Close the programs. Okay, there we are. We're good. I, I, I'm going to be over here for a while. I'm going to be in the bouncy castle. Yes, that is Stan's bouncy castle. He's the boss of this building. And he has a bouncy castle. This yes. boss is amazing. I must go meet him. Hold on. Let's not go through there just yet. No. Come this way. Oh. Ooh. There are a few secrets around this map. One being just this way. See, uh, he knows what he's doing, so <laughs> I'm just gonna keep. Yes, I do. I played this map several times before, and I've watched the videos around it, so I know how to make something that is actually featured in this. Like, oh, yeah. Oh, <laughs> I guess that works. <laughs> uh. Real bouncy Stan, castle. Is that you? <laughs> we. <laughs> oh, now I gotta climb uh, the whole thing. Yep. Nice We're ladder though. Well. That's pretty cool. Instead of a wooden ladder, like a steel ladder. Best part is it even sounds like metal. Oh wow! Yeah, I can barely hear it, but yeah. It's like the food here has been oh, hold on. Maybe I should have put myself on a Do Not Disturb on Discord. Yeah, probably important. Speaking of which, I will have the links to our both of our Discords in the description. Don't forget to go check out Mr. Finia Poo. Yeah. Hop, hop. Hop, hop. So, this is the GDL facility. Now, I know you've probably seen this logo somewhere else. Probably. Let's take a look here. Like, you remember the, um, the flag that I made... Yes. Forum. Yes, you've seen that logo before. I have. Now, are you ready? I am. Are you? Three, 
two, one. Oh, welcome, welcome! We were expecting you almost half an hour ago. But being a tad late is far better than being melted to death and never showing up, am I right? <laughs> okay, we are already running late, so you should probably head upstairs to begin Alan's briefing on the mission. Uh, Good luck! Oh, th thank you, Have Sasha. Uh, See you soon! Okay. Have a nice trip! Uh, you, you can be quiet now, Sasha. Are, are they gone? No. Are we finished? No. Whew. I'm right here. <laughs> That was definitely my first reaction when I played this. <laughs> <laughs> but first, before we go up to see Alan, let's go around here. Just take in the view for everything. And no, these uh, villagers do not move. They're always stuck in place. Why? Except for some of these. Some of these are free to move for some reason. Maybe they want to move around. Liven up. All these, like, professors. Mm -hmm. Okay, at least really... it's not gibberish, at least it's English. Yeah. Yeah, they always made, made sure it was in English. Oh, okay, there's, two... oh, there's one thing you to see. You see that lever right there? Pull Why don't the you lever, flick it? Where, where? Right there? Pull the lever, my crunk. Stan loves you. Stan's the kind of guy who's not that great at socializing. Stan's the kind of guy who gets tons of flowers from his workers. Out of pity. Stan's the kind of guy who has to force himself to love his work. Stan's the kind of guy who brings a bouncy castle to work. Stan's the kind of guy who doesn't actually exist, but we can hope. Stan's the kind of guy who gets employed the month all the time. Stan's the boss healer. Oh, oh my gosh. Um, I, I... That little Easter egg that the Nox crew put in. And boy, one of my favorites. I'm actually legitimately creeped out. <laughs> I'm just gonna go ahead and shut that right there. Now yeah. there is one thing that they um, one of the voices that they do have here. It's uh, wheels on the bus go in a circular motion because that's how they work. <laughs> what? The voices are just amazing. Most of them were made by Noxide, as a matter of fact. It's just the Jerry Raider. Beautiful. Ah. Uh -huh. <laughs> and just the models for the computer. <laughs> the models for the computer are amazing, I must say. That's a lot of different um custom things that they made other than just models for blocks. Like this here. You see this on top of this table, that clipboard? Oh wow. What is that? It's actually a few different things. It's um lime green carpet. And there's a few different um, versions. I've got seen all different kinds of carpets. But actually it's all the same carpet. There's different models. Let's check out over here. Like another model the is this seat. cup. The seat, that's actually an end um end portal frame. They didn't um, have a texture for the um, the end portal frame with the eye in it. Because why would they need one? Right. And look at this. You see this plant? Beautiful plant. It's actually a barrier underneath, and it's just um, a powered rail. <laughs> because if you press this button that's right behind it... <laughs> well, <that was> a <laughs> so little things in this map that just really make it better. Ah, you're the wrong way. Oh. I, I'm, I'm already lost in here. This is why mm -hmm. I have you. It's just, the one thing that I was really kind of interesting about is, why is there just this random Coke can on this floor? It's probably Sasha! Gosh darn it, Sasha! Why are you throwing your trash all the way around, huh? Why are you doing <laughs> that? How about next time you actually hit the garbage can? Oh, there should be one behind your desk! Anyway. Which actually there isn't. There's also a barrier preventing us from going back there. Well, you know anyway, <laughs> I wish there was a way that we could go down here, but there isn't. I really wish there was. Spectator Literally mode. nothing down there. <laughs> well, there's nothing down there anyway. Remember, we can't get into spectator. There's command blocks preventing us, but I know how to turn that off. Press to start presentation. Uh, hang on, I just want to double check everything here before you do. To do dank memes. Oh, here we go. 
This is where I can thrive, right here. We're going to be doing some dank memes on this chair, right here. We're, we're going to be... We're gonna be having some dank memes. What was that for? <laughs> what was that for, huh? Box some sense into, yeah. <laughs> also, because I have Optifine, glass now is seamless. Oh, I bet that looks beautiful. Uh, yes, it does. Except for those glass panes over the top, they're uh, uh, panes. That's a pane, yep. It's a block. Those blocks are not correct. All right, let's go ahead and uh, I'm going to be right near the projector. All right, let's I'm start sure the presentation. Not sure if you knew this, but uh, right-click the chair. Presentation recorded and made for strict use of the Geo Descent Lab grounds only. <clears throat> right. Let's see. Ah, yes. <clears throat> Welcome. <clears throat> Thank Welcome. you. <clears throat> Welcome to Geo Descent Labs, where digging into the past is of the past, because we're digging into the future instead of the past. Need to work on that. <laughs> My name is Alan Columbus, and I'm the one in charge of running the operations here. So, please do take a seat, as the following presentation will outline your mission in adequate detail. Yes. Right. Approximately 30 years ago, we sent a bore drill with a two-man crew to create a tunnel to the center of the Earth. However, once that drill reached the core, we lost all communication with the crew. And, um, well, the, 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 the crew themselves. So, the Makes project sense. was completely shut down due to the unforeseen casualties. I mean, I, mean, I, I say unforeseen, but you know nature of the <clears throat> now fast forward to about a year ago we discovered a new type of rock deep down in the earth named noxesium that when cooked at a temperature of 3456 degrees along with a cow's udder, apple cider vinegar a few gummy bears dried washing up liquid and a spleen of a you, you, you know what? In brief, it allowed us to create a new alloy that we managed to translate into a fully-fledged metallic wingsuit named the Thermal Flight Armor 1541. This suit is made Still to withstand the man. highest heats known to man, and so we believe, the center of the Earth. This is where you come in. You have been hired for a mission to fly down to the center of the Earth. Wearing okay. the Thermal Flight Armor 1541 to rescue the long-lost bore drill. Providing that it's intact, you should be able to use the power in your suits to power it up and drive it all the way back. It would also be nice to recover the bodies of the crew. Yeah, that, that would and, be great. Um, bring them back for their families. Okay, let's talk about how you're going to do it. The bore drill gradually made its way to the Earth's core through three separate tunnels in a zigzag formation. You will glide using your suits all the way down to the center of the Earth through these tunnels. At the end of tunnel one and two, there is a base camp that you can use to rest up at. Right. However, beyond tunnel three, well, it's all on you at that point. Listen, I don't know what you're going to find down there, but I'm sure you all agreed upon the possible dangers when you signed up for this job. Yeah. Right, as soon as this brief is finished, you'll head out the door behind you and follow the route down to the armory where you will equip your brand spanking new Thermal Flight Armor 1541s and then progress to the drop zone. Um, S Sasha, is it is it possible to get this recording to um <clears throat> self-destruct after it's finished? Y you know, like the um, Mission Impossible film. No? What do you mean, no? Okay. Okay, ne never mind. <laughs> Marty. <clears throat> well. K kaboom! Kaboom! Okay, I'm just gonna, you know, <clears throat> go ahead and. Yeah, alright. <laughs> Kaboom! <laughs> Kaboom! I suppose I could have waited for the description at the end, couldn't I? But yeah. yeah. So in here, hang on, I'll see if it's down here. Nice. Oh, uh, just a little balcony. All right. Actually, why don't you come down here and uh, press that button right there? Press again, and then look at me. 
presents for lunch? That did nothing. No, it did. Do you have particles turned on? Oh, no. I, I turned off particles. Turn them on. Okay. Oh, it's a hiss. Gotcha. All right. Now, there's actually um, three other portions of the map that do this as well. But sadly, we can't go there anymore. Oof. Hang on. And now, of course. Oh, no. Oh, okay. the Hall of Engineers. My name is Stan. Yeah, Stan, the kind of guy that doesn't like his face on things. Makes sense. Hence, he doesn't have a head here. Got Zoidberg. Yes, Avondale. I'm actually friends with him on Discord, believe it or not. And somehow we also live relatively close to each other. The more you know. Kind of freaky, to be honest. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yes, this is all of the engineers that designed this map, and oh my god. Are they wonderful? Ah, oh, yes. They will. Just because. Alright. Hello, how are you? Hi. How are you? Uh, we can go back here. <laughs> Oh. It's like nothing to do back here, but we can go back terrorize <laughs> this guy. Oh. Sadly, it's invulnerable. Of course. Are you ready? I'm ready. Here we go. So. Mm hmm. Yep. How's your day? Okay, there we go. When you turn on your perspective and look outside it. Like, if you turn on perspective and then look up. <laughs> I'm good. <laughs> you can see the out. Oh, well, flying is not enabled on the server. Oof, I'll wait here for you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, well, that was fun. Oh, oof. Um, where am I? You are underneath. Oh! I fell through. Are you sure allow flight equals true in your server settings? <laughs> this is not. Yep. Yeah, yep. Yeah. Hold on. Well, hello. There you <laughs> go. Hi. Sometimes you can fall through the floor. Like, on there is actually. um. What they did is use armor stands to put shulker boxes on top of them. Oh. You can actually stand on a shulker box on an armor stand. That's a little trippy. It's a niche, though. That's how they are able to do that. Oh, we're in the armory. Okay, we're in the armory. Yes, we are. It's a little bit loud in here. A little bit, but it's okay. Oh, here we go. What's over here? Videos of baby sharks. Pictures of baby sharks. Sharks feeding for beginners. List of evil mastermind lairs. Play lunch, lost, and found. Printed, printed gifs or gifs. Uh. Light suit <laughs> manual. Polish translation, history of people eaten by sharks. Wow, okay, someone's got a fascination. Shark feeding for beginners, you missed that one. Uh, well, in any event, we got lots of... One thing I kind of uh, wish they would actually... Oh, hi! Ah, <laughs> uh, yes. The Knox Cruise Shark. I forget its actual name. There's a name for it. Oh, it's over here. Well, for now, I'm going to call uh, you Lawrence. Dumb Shark. That's what it's called, Dumb Shark. Oh, okay. It's a bat. It's an, well, it's a piece of lapis on top of an armor stand on top of a bat. And ready to destroy me. not the best me. thing you've seen. Because, of course, remember, the update Aquatic came out how much later? True. Then 1.11? <laughs> True. So, this is 1.11.2, folks, so the more you know. Yeah. We don't have any dolphins, which would have been great for this. <laughs> and then, of course, we have the Nox Mammoth. Oh, my. That actually does mimic Noxite's face. Oh, that is beautiful. <laughs> yes, it is. 
All right, and so you I'm guessing we need right to put click these signs. Original inhabitant of the Geodescent Labs Alpha Camp site, Dumb Shark was famously lured onto the hook of Dr. Minowski with a plate of salami. And some say the fabled Knox Mammoth was nearly a collector of treasure, but most experts agree that the excrement of a beast this size would prove fantastic. Individuals brave enough to inspect the rear of the gentle giants may be richly rewarded or not. Oh my. Uh -huh. <laughs> and there is a little bit of noxesium, if you will, behind the mammoth. You can barely see it, but it it it's there. All right. Anyway, so we have to how put about one we, of these uh, on? Yes, we do. Walk inside. Uh, Any of them. Let's do it at the same time. I'll go green, sure. You're going to go green? I'll go I'll go with the black one then. Ready? One, three. two, three. Whoa, okay. Okay. Put on F5. Hi, Ellie. For your safety, do not attempt to land the suit until I have deployed the landing gear. Do right. not drive the TFA one five four one into water, hot liquids, or magma. Deal. Enjoy your flight. Alrighty. Was that not the most amazing thing you've seen? That was very impressive, and I'm no. honestly scared now. <laughs> A little fun fact, 1541, does that number ring a bell? It does. What kind of a bell does this ring? I don't know. You tell me. 15th week, update 41. 1.11.2. Ah, uh, 1 1.9. 1.9. 1 1.2. Which was when the Elytra was first added into the game. Oh, okay. Hence, See. 1541. Had to think. See, you're, and, you're better at the Easter eggs than I am. And TFA, thermal flight armor. Yeah, I'm, I'm just going to take the flight armor this way. Thank you. Have a good one, guys. <laughs> take care. Bye. <laughs> Bye. Oh, yeah, the elevator. I can't leave. Now, what... The trick that they actually used to pull off this is when we came out of the elevator, we actually teleported to a slightly different area. Very slightly. It's one of the most used tricks of Minecraft, really. And just this here, I mean... <laughs> uh, what are you doing? <laughs> He's climbing the ladder, oh, thinking if there's something there. I wish there was just an... You can't uh, wait? I wish there was an Easter egg like that. That would have been funny. Alright. Yes. Call elevator. If hey. the elevator does happen to be down the bottom floor, you can just press that button and it'll come back up. Hang on. Oh, you left the game. Or, or flying is unable to the server. That can happen too. Alright, that being said, what? we're about ready to start jumping in, aren't we? I'm not sure why I keep doing that. Oh. Are you second? Okay, when I come on, I'm teleporting to you. Alright, well, I'm right next to you, so... As soon as I get on, I need to move. Okay. I think we're good. Alright. Yes, we're good. <laughs> that being said, though, I think we're just about ready to fly out here, aren't we? Yes. Before Let's we do so... Quick. quick, before I decide to... All right, as we're entering the drop zone here. Oh, flying is not enabled on this server. Um, why? What? What? what, what why? Um. The Terra Swoop Force has arrived. Descent no, we haven't. Will initiate upon activation of door controls. Okay, I oh, push, thank God. I pushed the button. Oh, there we go. <laughs> uh, hold on a second. Did we? Are we in the drop zone? 
Yeah, we are. Hold on. Okay. Whew. I'm gonna... Technical difficulties, please stand by. Bon cow utter... Wait. This is for the alloy. Right yes, here. Now, one thing we might actually have to uh, do is I'm going to go back into the server.properties and uh, Let me get to the water turn cover. flight on. Well, that is A-OK. -okay. We'll let you go ahead and take care of that. Besides, we need something for the next episode when we actually start jumping in. So I, personally, I'm going to leave this one here. What do you think, Toby? I think so. All right. Thank you so much for watching. If you haven't already... Hit the like button on both the videos and subscribe to Toby as well. Hi, hi. Hello. Hello. And don't forget everyone on my side. Go enjoy Fibu. He makes live streams every... How many times a week? <laughs> <laughs> Depends on my work schedule. <laughs> that, it definitely does. And then my schedule doesn't even exist, so... We'll get there eventually, but we are regular uploaders. That's what matters most. So, trying to bring you quality content. Again, thank you so much for watching. And as always, I'm Finia Poo. I'm Toby Mistraft. And we're both signing off. Take care, everybody. We'll see you guys soon.